Mohammad Shamir Bashir accused of defrauding a city based seafood company to the tune of rupees 3.3 crore was produced in court. The court has granted him judicial custody for the next 15 days. As reported, Bashir, a resident of Ullal, was arrested by Pandeshwar police earlier this month for defrauding the seafood company he was working for through fraudulent transactions worth rupees 3.3 crore. Bashir allegedly created fake email accounts and after entering into a tacit understanding with fish importers located overseas, he reportedly caused loss to his company by diverting the business to the competitor. Bashir's father K. Abbas and wife Humaya Banu are also accused in the case as the properties were in their names. However, sources said that they are not directly involved in the fraud. The police are also in the hunt for Chang Lee, a Korean national against whom the crime branch is said to be having substantial evidence of fraudulent breach of contract and criminal conspiracy against the Manglo based company. Mohammad Ishan, whose role in the case is being investigated, is absconding in Korea. Bashir earned a salary of rupees 12,000, was working with the firm for nine years. He has built a house worth rupees 1.5 crore with furniture worth rupees 50 lakhs, brought a fisheries boat, a poultry farm, and set up a chicken stall by name of Honest Chicken and set up a company in Singapore as well. This apart, Ishan is said to have set up his own company called Indigo Protein in Korea. It is said that Ishan, Bashar and their compliances lived a lavish life, travelling by flights to various places in the country and abroad on weekends and splurged money on seven-star suits. Bashar owned five vehicles, a Nissan, two Innovas, a Swift and a Tavera, all of which have been seized by the police. South African Blade Runner Oscar Pistorius, a double amputee who became one of the biggest names in world athletics, was charged with shooting dead his girlfriend at his home in Pretoria on Valentine's Day. Early morning, confused by the sound, he shoots his lover, Riva, the police said. Wrong statues of late Minister for Higher Education, V.S. Acharya, were unveiled at the UDP CMC office and in front of the DC complex at Manipal Endpoint being the first death anniversary. District Minister and State Minister for Muzra and Ports, Kota Srinivas Pujari unveiled the statues. Once again the main headlines. MCC surplus budget for 2013-14 focuses on development and waste. Surprise rain in Mangalore City, temperature down on February 15th. Multicrore fraudster Bashir granted judicial custody. This is all in this edition. For more news, keep watching V4 News 24-7 or you may also log on to v4news.com.